Uh, hello, uh, my name is uh, Hugo Orte and I'm uh, the program director uh, of the Master of Education at the Faculty of Education of the University of Hong Kong. I'm here to present in broad lines what this master um, is about. First of all, let's talk about the key features of, of the program. People come to the Master of Education for three main reasons. Um, they want to know a little bit more about education as a field of study. They want to specialize uh, in a particular area related to education and um, or they want to know a little bit more about how to do research. We teach all of this, although the students can, to some extent, choose uh, which key feature of the program they want to focus on. We have five uh, learning, main learning outcomes. Uh, the first one is to demonstrate and communicate about up-to-date knowledge of an area of specialization in the broader context of education. Second, apply knowledge and skills to understand, critically evaluate and or conduct educational research. Third, engage in inquiry-based and evidence-informed practice in response to challenges and novel situations. Fourth, reflect on important educational values such as social justice, equity and fairness in their own cultural and educational context and enhance their advocacy skills for those values. And fifth, to adhere to personal and professional ethics when engaging in educational practices and conducting academic research. Basically, the program has two parallel strands. The generalist strand, where um, usually the students that do not have a clear idea or an interest in a particular specialism usually apply for. And the idea is mainly for those that are not necessarily in the field of education, or not working in the field of education, but have an interest in education. So for those of you who are interested in education without having a clear idea of what you really want to learn, this is a good strength to apply for. Otherwise, if you work in the field of education already or have a clear idea about what you want to learn, we have um, several programs uh, which are divided into specialist strands non-language related and those who are language related. Those who are language related, you have the English language related and the Chinese language related. And I call your attention particularly to the specialist strand on Chinese language, which are IB recognized specialism, at least two out of three that are offered by the faculty. Now, in terms of the program structure, both strands encompass 30, 60 credits in total. The specialist strand um, has a compulsory core course, six credits, plus four specialist courses, 24 credits, plus three specialist or general electives, 18 credits, and 12 credits from the capstone. The generalist strand has a different structure, has a compulsory core course, six credits, plus seven general electives, 42 credits, plus the capstone, 12 credits. Now, the compulsory core course, uh, which is educational issues and research, is a broad course that tends to inform students on key educational concepts and issues and introduces students to educational research. Now, the specialist courses, which are six credits each, uh, comprise of specialist knowledge areas. Each specialism has four specialist courses, and we have here two examples, comparative and global studies in education and development, who have four courses addressing the global local nexus in education, themes and approaches in the field of comparative education, critical issues in education reform, and education for sustainable development. All of these courses are mandatory for those of you who decide to take, for example, the comparative and global studies in education and development. If you think about going to the English language education, uh, program is exactly the same thing, of course, with different core disciplines, but uh, it works exactly the same way. Now, uh, in terms of the specialist and general electives, also six credits each, you have specialism electives, which are additional courses closely related to particular specialisms, and uh, they will allow students of those specialisms and other specialisms to pursue a more in-depth understanding of those particular specialisms um, and we have here an example, specialist electives for IB related specialisms will tend to apply for a specific IB certificate. General electives provide students with the opportunity to study areas that they are interested in or that are relevant to their professional research so as to broaden their knowledge and general appreciation of education. 
And we have here other examples such as cultural and ethical and legal awareness for teachers, psychology and education of the gifted and talented, counseling processes, ethics and skills, and advanced research methods courses. Now, the capstone project uh, is basically divided into two possibilities. You can choose either to do a professional portfolio or a research portfolio. Both options will require students to apply what they have learned on the program and demonstrate their achievement of the program learning outcomes. You will be provided with capstone seminars and the supervision of a teacher. Now, in terms of close contact and study modes, let's start with study mode. We have two types of study modes, one for full-time students, which are expected to complete the program in one year. Uh, eventually, the program can be extended, but to no more than two consecutive years, or for part-time students, which are expected to complete the program in two years, uh, eventually they can extend up to no more than four consecutive years. In terms of class contact, and, uh, basically 24 hours of lectures for specialist courses and electives, 10 sessions or 2.5 hour lectures or 8 sessions of 3 hour lectures. Courses are generally scheduled on weekday evenings, except for TCSL and TCLL full-time students, or occasionally on Saturdays. Activities include in-class activities, e-forums, individual and group study and work. The learning environment. Uh, English is the medium of instruction except for the Chinese language courses. There are opportunities to study other languages and cultures, and we have a diversity of students and teachers. Students and teachers from uh, over 20 countries, and you can interact with students that are also teachers, our principals, our educational officers, our university teachers, our sen senior civil servants, school supervisors and managers, policy analysts, tutors, entrepreneurs, and even mothers and fathers. Timeline. The application selection uh, is between February and May. Uh, the online registration in late July. Online course enrollment in early August. And the course commencement in early September. You can find the web link for online applications in front of you. An online application form is for a single specialism and single study mode only. You need to upload the required supporting documents according to the instructions, and these instructions may vary according to the course that you are interested in. In terms of contacts of the program, you have contacts over the phone, email, and um, any other way that you see fit and that we have available for you to contact us. And with this, I end this introduction and um, I'm looking for your application to the program. See you.